All right, guys, so today is another 4C Black Little Girl Hair Care, whatever the name of the videos are. Y'all know them by now. I have done like three or four videos today, so if you see me in the same shirt, it's because it's all on the same day. I got a lot going on. I wanted to show you guys, because I took all last week off, and I just feel so bad, so I feel like I need to boom, 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 hit y'all with a whole bunch this week. Um, not a whole bunch, but just like be regular, do my regular three videos, my Monday um, regular life, my Wednesday hair video, and my Friday food for Friday. And I haven't figured it out yet. Food for Friday. Not food for Friday, but my you know what I'm talking about. Friday. So, Grace's yeah. hair is dry. It hasn't been washed in a week. Um, and so I'm going to show you what I do to kind of get this, get her whole it, life together. It, so, so she doesn't look like this tomorrow okay. at school. All right, let's go. My let's tool begin. for this hairstyle to get this together is water and some of my hair crack which is just a butter okay so the butter of your choosing it could be like a double butter cream or your shea butter mixture that you make whatever that is those are my two things that i need to pull off how to detangle this dry hair and also tame the wild lion so let's get started all right so we're just gonna spritz with water for this hairstyle we're just gonna do some chunky plaits and so from this section, I'm just gonna apply my butter. I'm just gonna take my finger and separate, apply some butter to a chunk and just plait that chunk. So she's just gonna have chat, chatty, that's not a word. Chunky plaits all over her head. Turn Grace, put your head down. And we're just gonna clean that part up. It doesn't have to be perfect, but it needs to be. Because the parts are so chunky, I need it to be at least a little bit closer. Comb it through just a little bit. And then I'm just going to plait this section. Put your head down, Grace. Put your head down. Look how skinny she is. So my next part is just kind of like from here, across, all the way to the other side. So those are my three plaits down here. Done. And I'll figure out how to kind of group them together or something or put some beads on them. So my next part is just like this. And I'm going to do the same thing. I've spritzed water on it. I'm going to take chunks like this and just continue to play. Cat, cat my camera, helper. Uh, helmet cam on. So we watched her about three or four times. Beating. She was just showing me All right. This, in case you've never used a beater before, it's kind of like, it looks like this. There's, it's like a stick and then it's got a little hole. So what you do is you just put your hair through the beater, just like that. So it's going through the hole. And then you just take the beater and you pull the beads up through there, just like that. I'm gonna show you on one more. Put the hair through the hole. Stop, Grace. Through the hole. See that little hole right there? That hole right there? There it is. And then I'm just putting three on at a time. So I'm just gonna three, force yes. it right through, just like that. So now what I do is when I get to this point, I pull the last bead down to the end. I wrap the end up, just like that. Then I take my rubber band and I wrap it around the bead. And I just keep wrapping it and wrapping it and wrapping it and wrapping it and wrapping it. And then there's the rubber band around the hair. See the little extra hair right there? And I just pull it down and that's how I make it. All right guys, one thing I forgot to say, I need to add this in the video. The reason why I put beads on her plaits is because otherwise they're not, they don't have enough weight on them to lay down on their own, even with the scarf at night. So I put beads on them to give them a little weight. You know, um, I could only put three beads on there because the the plaits were kind of thick and only three beads would fit. However, if you get a bigger type of bead, you could probably fit more on there, but three seems to be fine. See, even with three back here, it still kind of sticks out just a little bit. So um, that's just kind of a tip for you. If you want to add weight to the hair so that it lays down, use beads or barrettes or something with a little weight to kind of pull them down. And there you have it, guys. 
This is the work of Mama Reed. She strikes again. Okay, so I have one little thing that I possibly could have done better. You see how chunky these three that I started with are? And as I move towards the top, they got smaller. So that would be the only thing that I would do different in this style. I do want to say this. I use Cream of Nature Argon Perfect Edges on her edges. Grace! <laughs> right here to slick it so that's one thing that i did thanks for watching this video make sure to like subscribe and all that good jazz big Little thumbs up girl natural big, haircut care big thumbs up big thumbs up bye